Hey everybody, today's an eventful day. Um, it's I went back to work today. Mm -hmm. Our cousins are still here. Yeah, I it's got all beautiful. my um, like ducks in a row for the rest of the week of everything I can get done. And apparently, all the entire state of Florida realizes a hurricane coming <laughs> our way. Um, so everyone's a little, a little on, on on edge, a little frantic uh, because it was the first day after the holiday weekend, realizing there's a Category Five hurricane coming towards Florida most likely. So, I mean, we don't want to joke around with it because it's a serious thing and we are going to prepare for it, but we don't know yet where it's going to go. And we are already preparing for it. Yeah, like we've got food. We're going to go grocery shopping later after we go to Epcot for and extra. hang out with our cousins to, for just a little bit extra supplies. But we also know like, I was talking to people who I work with and, and you can see online, I'm sure that like there's lines at stores already and gas stations are running out of gas and water are running out of at grocery stores but it's like this is florida they know what they're doing there's going to be pallets of water every morning at these stores and we don't even know it's going to be on a whole nother five or six days before it even hits the keys so we're going to enjoy our time with our family that is are visiting and we're going to go to walmart afterwards and I'll stop by some stores on the way to work or away from home from work this week. We're only two people, so we don't need that many supplies, but thank you for everybody. We've already gotten a few messages and comments worried about our, our safety and making sure we're prepared because everybody knows if you're watching us, we moved here five weeks ago. <laughs> and during our college program, we never had a hurricane. Said, like living in Chicago, it's like no tornadoes, no hurricanes, no earthquakes. We just get snow and you cold. You get the snow, but like. Chicago is a good place to be for weather. Yeah. And I was the kid that like watched the Weather Channel when I was little, and there was like a storm coming in five days, and I would get sick to my stomach. So. So think there's a storm. Good for being a there's, storm. There's a storm coming in five days, <laughs> and she's going to Epcot. Yeah, so, so we're gonna keep our spirits high and enjoy the magic of Disney, and we're gonna be smart about it. Something unprecedented just happened. What? Sarah went through security, got the got scanned, but I didn't. Soaring, flying. That's the club cool afternoon dance. So, do you agree that it is phenomenally beautiful outside? Like, there's almost no humidity. Yeah, this morning when I went and walked in, it's cold. For Florida standards or yeah, Chicago I was in standards? Tank top and shorts, and it was like it could still be outside. Did you see the flurries? I saw flurries this morning. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Oh my God. it it fills it up to the <laughs> <laughs> you have. <laughs> what did you do to your children? Ten <laughs> sardines, I got. Matthew. You like it? Try this. Try this one. You're twins, so I don't know how this is gonna go. Are you even getting any? Are you fibbing? Are <laughs> 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 oh, these nice? This is what it looks like to coordinate five children to take a picture with Norway or a troll. Okay, so today's a strange vlog because it's late. We couldn't film too much in the park with the cousins because we forgot to. And now we're at Walmart trying to get normal groceries plus hurricane groceries. And we're just having a good old time in this Walmart talking about how we need to buy all of this meat, even though the freeze, the power could go out. But Sarah was laughing so hard she started coughing like crazy. They're, they're low on bread, and the only kind of bread they have is the kind that Sarah... They have, um, they have bakery bread, if you want to get bakery. <laughs> they only have the kinds of like the high 
Brutos wheats and stuff that Sarah despises. Look at all these empty shelves right now. People are getting a little excited. I'm just looking for lunch food. Yes, please. I think we should get a thing of baked beans. I'll eat them cold for both of us. But I also feel bad all the bread's gone, but nobody apparently wants to eat pickles during a hurricane. You'll eat all the pickles, I'll eat all the beans. I think we're prepared now. Feel better about it. This is a, a full stacked cart and a treat ourselves. I'm having a Pepsi when we get home. Ooh. On the rocks. On the rocks. Hey everybody. We made it home. It's midnight. Before midnight. <laughs> I didn't think it was gonna be late, but I didn't think it was gonna be I thought it would be later than this kind of. Yeah. As weird as that sounds. But we're home, we had a fun night, did some interesting things. I didn't think that, so that's short, we didn't explain, but the short films at Pixar, at Epcot. That was awesome. It was a lot of fun, the seats move, it's like semi, like a it's new like version of Philhart Magic, but not as intense. Very, like very, intense in a different way. yeah, but very, very cool experience. Um, we're pretty, we're pretty, feeling pretty good about the storms. Obviously we have no idea what's going to happen, but we went to Walmart, got a lot of stuff. Um, Gonna, We've never been through a hurricane, so uh, if you if you have and you have any good advice, leave a comment down below. Um, we're thinking about everybody in the Keys and the Virgin Islands and everyone who's getting ready. Yeah. And tomorrow, what do we have planned? I'm going to the airport in the morning to pick up a friend from mm -hmm. college who has an, an interview here, so that's exciting. Mm -hmm. And our cousins have a rest day, so we'll probably do like a resort or something tomorrow night. Yeah. With that. It is good to be home. It is good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>